guys and welcome back to my channel. So y'all know that I am a huge fan of doing collabs and I have this influencer that I follow on Instagram and she's in a lot of the Instagram growing groups that I'm in and I adore her makeup y'all. I've been following her forever. She's got uh, how many? I'm going to check and I'm going to show you her Instagram because she is incredible. <clears throat> And she is one of my absolute favorites. She's got about 13,000 followers. This is her Instagram. Right here. And I have loved her page. Well, in our Instagram group, she announced that she was starting YouTube. So I reached out to her and I told her I would love to do a collab. Because since she just started her YouTube, she's still kind of getting it going. But she's going fast, you guys. And she actually said yes. I almost died and she does not know that I'm this excited because I had to play it cool so Marissa Benson darling I am so excited to be doing this collab with you and here's a quick clip of her so y'all can see what she looks like hi I'm Marissa I'm super excited to be collabing with Florence to create this look using the androgyny palette well she created a different look which you just saw or are about to see and um, it was cool like to see how we can both use the same palette and come up with two totally different things. So if you want to check out how I got this, go over to my channel and watch my video. Thanks. So we decided to do this collab and uh, she's new to YouTube so she hasn't really done collabs on here before. So we just did what I usually do and we picked a palette. and. Surprisingly, we both have a crap ton of palettes that we did not have that many in common. So we decided to go ahead and use the Jeffree Star Androgyny Palette. Here's the outside, and here's the inside. And we decided to use this to create two different looks. Now what you just saw earlier at the beginning, that is the look that I came up with. Uh, this is how I was feeling today, and I wanted some extra practice on my cut crease, and I thought I had figured out what I was doing wrong. And it's not completely better, but it's better than it was. And that's all that matters. So uh, we decided to do this. And this is my look I came up with as of right now. I still don't know what she came up with. I know it's incredible. And I know she's going to blow me out of the water. But that's okay. I can take that. She's amazing. So I don't mind. But um, yeah, so that is my intro. I'm rambling a lot because I'm just like... I'm not going to say I'm starstruck, but I'm definitely flustered and so excited that this video is actually going up. Like, this is amazing. It just makes me so happy, y'all. But um, we are going to go ahead and I'm going to quit rambling and quit being dumb. And we're going to go ahead and go straight into my tutorial. So here y'all go. Okay, so we are just going to dive right in. And we're going to start with Safe Word right here. Ignore my ratchet nails. There ain't nothing I can do about those right now. So we're just going to go in with Safe Word. Oh, I forgot how much fallout this has. And we're just going to put it all over the crease. And this is just our transition shade. Okay, y'all. So next, I'm going to go into Military right here. I have never really played in this shade, but I think it's super pretty. So we're going to play in it today and see how it looks. Okay, so next we are going to take Poison, and we're going to start that about halfway through the crease, just barely bring it over and bring it out into this outer corner. Okay, so then I'm going to go into Swallow, that is this dark blue right here. And I'm just going to dab that in this outer corner because I want to get that gradient effect going through here. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and put some concealer on to cut the crease. But y'all know that that is not my strong suit. So I'm going to get off of here while I do that. 
Okay, so next I'm going to go into frosting. That is our gold right here. And I'm going to pick it up on a flat brush. And I'm going to try to pick up a whole bunch. And then I'm going to spritz it with just a teeny bit of MAC Fix Plus. And see if we can get some super good pigment out of this color. Okay guys, so I got that gold laid down. I'm actually pretty happy with how this looks. I usually don't like my cut creases this much. This size is definitely better. But my practice is paying off. So now I'm going to go ahead and do my liner and lashes. And then I'll be right back for that lower lash line. Okay, so I got some lashes on. And these are the Shop Luxe lashes that I told y'all about forever ago. Um, and now I'm just going to attack this lower lash line. So for this, I'm going to go ahead and take Poison and line that up really close to my waterline. Okay, and now that I have that on there, I'm gonna take this little brush that I used for my gold, and I'm gonna dip it into Safe Word, and we are gonna blend out this lower lash line with this just a little bit. Okay, so all I have left to do to my eyes is just go ahead and put on some mascara on these bottom lashes. Okay, so now I'm going to go finish up my lips and I will be right back with an outro for you guys. Okay guys, so I got these lips done and if you've been watching my videos, you probably saw last Saturday exactly how I did these because this is the tutorial that went up. I know it was short, y'all I'm sorry, I'm slacking. But I went ahead and did some ombre lips and finished out this look. And I'm so excited. This was such a fun look to make. And it was a really fun collab to do. Um, yeah, and I think while you're watching this, I told you this Saturday. But I'm going to tell you this again. I'm 98% sure that while you're watching this, I finally hit 1,000 subscribers. And if I have, thank you so much, you guys. That means the world to me. And just for that... Uh, by now, when you start seeing my new videos, I also should have all my filming area set up so we ain't got no more of these shadows and I should have a better backdrop, I hope, by the time you start watching my newer videos because I have a friend coming in and we're going to overhaul this filming area if I have anything to say about it. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that is it for this video. I'm so excited that we did this collab. Be sure that you go check out Marissa's video. I'm going to stick it in a card. I don't know where the cards go. And I'm going to stick it in the description along with the link to enter my giveaway. That even though I've probably already hit 1,000, it is still going until Craig Funds hits 5,000. So go check Marissa out. Go show her some love and tell her I sent you. Also, go follow our Instagrams. Mine's always in the description. And I'll stick hers down there, too. And, yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you enjoy Marissa's channel because I know that I do. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.